yeah, here we have the manager guy and Dr. Augustine talking about what is the wealth of the planet. Park Shut diplomat. your pie hole. Or what, Ranger Rick? You gonna shoot me? I can do that. Yeah, can we just take this down a couple of notches, please? If you throw a stick in the air around here, it's gonna land on some sacred fern, for Christ's sake. There's some kind of electrochemical communication between the roots of the trees. Each tree has 10 to the fourth connections, and there are 10 to the 12th trees on Pandora. It's more connections in the human brain. They can upload and download data, memories, at sites like the one you just destroyed. What the hell have you people been smoking out there? They're just goddamn trees. The wealth of this world isn't in the ground. It's all around us. So this is like, this is the theme, which I think is actually a great one, that the corporate guy is so laser focused on making money with, with the unobtainium that he's missing a place where he could make even more money, mm. which is the tree internet. Like that's worth more monetarily, forget about the wealth and right. the other aspects, but m worth more monetarily than the unobtainium. Even if it's not like uh, obviously financially mm, monetizable, like right away, mm -hmm. like we could come up with some reasons why it would be, how it would be monetized like immediately, right? Right. This is like a, a, a biological system that you could just pour water and sunlight and it grows up into this memory device. Like we don't have to have right. like, we don't have this, have this like nano layer deposition making magnetic storage. Just, no, no, no. Way simpler. You just drop a tree down. Right. And it interfaces with biological brains for free. We don't have right. to make wetware or interfaces or like do weird experiments. Wetware, on like we don't have to like plug, like we don't have to make like, what's it called? Cyborg people where you have like yeah. connection points in their brain. Right. Or you don't have to like sit in front of a monitor and keyboard and type with your fingers. Like you right. just plug in, you get all the information just right. downloaded right to your brain. And it's made for biological systems naturally, not in some mm. like technology weird way. Mm. So this is something about like corporations get like laser focused on like, I'm going to make money my way and that's it. Which right. actually is probably extremely suboptimal. I mean, they, gosh. They could make money we, in any other ways this corporation should immediately pivot to tree internet we'll make money that way right instead of well i mean i guess the the real world example is instead of cutting down the amazon rainforest for wood which is like money right now like right. there's a wealth of biology inside the amazon rainforest there's like right. medicine for days just right. sitting there we just don't know about it yet right so like capitalism is like we should make money but if we're so blinded by like i want the wood now Capitalism cuts down the tree, but optimal capitalism would actually protect mm -hmm. the rainforest mm -hmm. because it'd be like, there's so much wealth in there. We would be idiotic to cut it down. Agreed. So it's a yeah, flaw. So this, this business guy is more like middle management. He does not right. have the long-term vision. That's right. And society, it's not in society's benefit for them to mine the unobtainium. Right. It's in society's benefit for them to make, to study the tree internet. Or at least to drive around to other parts of the planet and see if there's unobtainium elsewhere. Heck, why don't they just do a survey using one of the various flying machines they have? That's and right. then next time they, they come down the shuttle, just land there. Like You, you, right. you have access to the entire moon. Like you have, <laughs> that's, drop shuttle. that's right. So if they, if they have access to the entire moon, survey the entire moon. If there's like a desert area or like some barren area that has lots of un unobtainium. And you don't have to first. deal with combat with the locals. Like, go there. Right, right. Yeah. So are they optimally doing capitalism? I, I don't think so, because they Absolutely obviously not. are blind to the wealth of the world, right. and they're just brute forcing it. Right. Even if you, like, at first when I thought of this, I thought of it as, like, the wealth of the world being more like a spiritual, emotional mm -hmm. thing. But even if you like strip that away and turn it into like a technology, like an applicable mm -hmm. technology, like mm -hmm. right there. Heck, even if you do it to sell advertisements to the Navi, you have the yeah. whole history of all their species. Like you know exactly how to target them. <laughs> yeah. I, I view this as like, say, the car companies. You know, they're like, we're going to make internal combustion engines and that's it. That's because we're capitalists. We make money that way. That's it. That's right. But then, then Elon comes in and makes electric cars, and now his car company is worth more than all the gasoline car companies combined. Yeah. So they were not making money optimally. They should have right. like looked into alternative technologies because that's worth more. 
So they say they're trying to optimize money, but really they're just, just blind. They're making every quarter they're making their they're black and that's it. Right. But they're not optimally making money. They could make a lot no, more. Absolutely not. They're, yeah. So this is a good theme. I like this, where it's like capitalists are like, I'm in for making money. But actually, you're not. You're interested in making a little bit of money right now. Right. And you're interested in making money in your blinded, narrow vision way. I like this theme. Hmm. Good thing.